Hey, it's Coley if you don't know, and it is time for some more of the long run where we are playing Lufia. The Fortress of Doom reloaded. So last time um we got to here. Um I forget where here is. I am gonna say this, I, I have been heavily spoiled by how, you know, games are presented now. So I don't remember the name of this town, but I remember why we're here. And this guy kind of makes it a little easier to remember. Um, apparently, Jaren here is being uh, held for ransom at a nearby dais. And uh, we gotta go stop what's, uh, what's going on. Uh, in between episodes, I did go through and uh, sort out my inventory. I've kept some of the gear, not a whole lot of it. I did sell off the bloody sword because at this point it's not an upgrade for anyone. But uh, yeah, we have about one and a half full pages to work with, so... We got some and dang way. And find my way to wherever it is. Right Monsters around here. Also, we are currently. Ooh, my character is uh, at level 15, which means we can go to the old cave, I believe. I am going to. Okay. I'm gonna hold off until at least everyone is at level 15, but uh, that is good to know. Uh, maybe we should talk to some people to figure out where that deus is. Because I don't remember. Let me offer them a ransom for Jaren. How can you do such a thing? Right. You're, you're the shopkeeper. You're, you're not going to tell me anything useful? I have this the strength to fight. Okay, an island to the west that I believe is uh, surrounded by three other uh, islands. Deus, the island to the west. We want to go over to a cave. If I'm not mistaken, we also have. Yeah, we have the Deus key. Okie doke. Um, so we gotta go to the west. And goodness knows I'm probably gonna get lost. Attack. Um, is it? Drop it, right? And Luffy levels up and learns stronger. Okay, oh, that is uh, 
not the correct move. Work. And I have to rain and grumble. Anything in this muck? Looks like no. Still worth checking. Because you never know when there's gonna be something. I'm gonna get the item float. Yeah, come to think of it, I should probably have also um, sorted my magic. I can do that for next time. Got another surprise attack. Interesting that they would give us mimics without um, having to like open a trap chest or something. Sort of like the tricks in um, Seven Saga. Okay, definitely use magic on the uh, minutes. Also, they run away. That is not the correct magic. They don't have a whole lot of health, actually. Uh, also, I think I want to go back. Because in order to get those two chests there, I think I have to go around the other way. Oh, and these guys, these guys summon more. Good. Good to know. I have a feeling that the um, encounter rate in this area is a bit high. I don't know if you guys noticed. Also, I just realized how low um, Lufia's health is. I should probably heal her. Of course, if they're just going to continuously uh, temporarily drain my defense, gonna be an easy fight because they're not gonna be doing any damage. Um, okay, maybe I'm gonna do a little bit of sorting right now, actually. Droplet stays there. Flash. Then bang. There we go. I think that's how I want it. And that's good. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and get drunk. Get drunk. I 
forgot why I was here. Oof. That's a big party and I'm glad that I managed to um, get the drop on it. Surprise on these minics. And his bang, see if that uh, has a good effect on them. Not really, no. Looks like nothing, like they just have really high both uh, magic and resistance. They just kind of go at it until either I take them down or they run away. There we go. My level goes up now they're in statue. the big hit. Um, Luffy can't take another one of those. Especially not after that uh, defense drop. Fortunately, Aguro was the one to take that. And there we go. A spell source and a life source. So the spell source I will give to me, the life source I will give to Lydia. A mind drug and a power drug here. Mummy! Oh dear. Let's go ahead and uh, give me a bonk on the noggin. Before that happens, crap. Well, fortunately, it appears that no one is dead yet. Well, there goes that. Yeah, I got an antidote, but I need an antidote to dead. I'm just glad that, like, when you die, you don't lose all of your uh, magic, because that would really suck. Uh, these things are really dreadful. 
Unfortunately, the flash didn't do it. Yeah, great job using a mirror there. I'm just going to mash you instead. Okay, so you're poisoned. Twelve antidotes. Still a fair amount of booze. I want those boxes. Did I do the wrong thing? Let's go back. Let me get the boxes. Yeah, I think uh, the cave that I went through originally was where I needed to keep going to get those boxes. It looked like a way forward, so I just kind of decided, nah, but let's go back and get uh, those boxes down there. Well, that ain't great. Okay. Problem solved. Stop it. Get some help. Let's mash through for our last enemy here. Okay, I'm pretty sure we got everything this time. And that was gonna take care of that little uh, jerk in the corner. Seeing as, like, at the moment I don't really have anything good to, to fight the mimics, I'll just mash them as best as I can. Okay. Ooh, nice crit. Dodge. Nice damage. Mm. Ooh, and a warp zone. Oh, this ain't a warp zone. This is that dais. Hmm. I take a guess and figure that there probably are not any random encounters. I'm just gonna take a look around and doesn't look like there's anything really interesting. Koya, look! Isn't that Jaren? She's still a child. Not really. Look at her carefully. She's half elf. The blood of elves and humans mixed. I've heard of this, but never seen it until now. If she's half elf, you can't tell her age by looking, can you? 
Her age doesn't matter now. What should we do, Coolio? But we can't leave things like this. Let's get these two in front of the stairs. That's how we can help her. Uh, that might have been Luffy saying that, actually. Wasn't paying attention. That's easy, but they'll just kidnap someone else. We have to stop this kidnapping nonsense once and for all. Oh, interesting. So I, I just get a, um, okay, that's neat. Now we only got an HP restore. We didn't get an MP restore. Do I want to, I think I might want to bolster Luffy here. And he's just a little bit. Oh. There's the MP Restore. I feel so sorry for Jaren. Can't go this way. Leave now. to be doing because it definitely seemed like we are going to like take these guys on ah. Coolio, Jaren Oh no! The monster flew to the North Tower. Maybe Jaren's on, on the top floor. Is everything really alright? Are you sure we, we haven't started something that can't be stopped? Uh, it doesn't seem like a, like a great time here. Actually, I just realized this is also a save point. Let's go ahead and take advantage of that. Okay, let us float. I doubt there's any um, items on the overworld, but there is no harm in checking, honestly. Also kind of interesting that there is a... Um, there's a two-level spread right now. My character is level 16 and Agro is 14. Now it leads it to believe that there is, like, the, uh, the experience uh, curve is not the same for everyone. Although, Agra just saw the dub, so... Okay. Oh boy, looks like a teleporter maze. I'm definitely gonna miss some items here, but we'll get what we can. Bolt ring. Big ol' nothing. Cool. And a dude. The roof has many warp zones, but don't step on the one at the far end. Okay.
are getting a little rough around this uh, this part of the world. Probably going to run out of the cure. Fools, you can't fight while sober. So this is probably what they mean by don't stand on the one at the far end. It's probably that one right there that looks different. Well, that ain't great. Actually, using our high arrows might be a good idea here. Oh, that's even worse. Um, This is very bad. Uh, that uh, that is not doing the amount of damage I was hoping for. I think that's it. We got ambushed by just exactly the sort of party that um, completely explodes us. Hey, Gamba. Glad you could make it for me dying. Oh, that puts us back here. Oh, that's not ideal. Oh, we saved over there. I mean, usually I would just take the death and continue going, but like... In this case... It literally is saving time to reload. Well, gives us some opportunity to uh, explore some more. I feel like we're going to get some nice amounts of damage for, for a little bit here. My girl levels back up. Now there is some... There's some lighter spaces here, and I'm just wondering, like, this has got to mean something, right? I definitely feel like this, this has got to mean something. I'm going to take a screenshot. Put this um, 50 
this in. Put this over here. Ah, I see. Yeah, there was a gap there. Your taxes, Yodo? Why? Okay, that gives us a revive. Then if I go directly left. Right. I'll leave it open just in case. I don't think I'm going to need it again. That was the source of our chagrin last time. All that and the enemies that could just attack our entire party. of this we can uh, take out here. All right, and there go all of the straw balls. Yeah, you can take a, you can keep taking out our defense power. That's perfectly fine. I'm just gonna kill you. Straw doll has a long nail. What does that do? That's not the correct button. A nail meant for use in hexes. I don't know what that means. Ooh, nice crit. Um. 
honestly probably should focus more on uh, the uh, the archers here who can attack the entire party. And yet I didn't do that and just spread my damage all over the place. Like a buffoon. And look where look what that got me. And even better, two of them. Okay, can I have a turn please game? Thank you, game. I would like to not die. Cool. Uh, apparently so. Also, hey, Jewel. Oh, three straw dolls. Great. Hydration achieved, and I will uh, I will do the other thing once uh, I have locked in everyone else's uh, next turn. Wow, these bombs are garbage. Now that, on the other hand, also I totally have the time to actually just stretch there. And whatever, I'll just do it now. Just get it done. Also, I heard my controller disconnect. Please stop disconnecting, controller. Thank you. Give me a second. Check my Wi-Fi cable. Okay. We're, we're there. Also, that is absolutely not what I wanted to do. Now I'm probably screwed. At least they're not trying to curse Lufia, because that would be very bad. Okay, thank goodness. We, we got through that. You're gonna need a lot more liqueur going forward. Nice. Look at my gold. One, 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 one. Okay, cool, but I don't want to go fight the boss yet. I want what's in that box. Mm. 
Oh boy, some more high arrows. Oh, high arrow. That's coming through, isn't it? Give me a second. And as soon as I come back, the sound stops. <sighs> okay, don't know what's up with this cable, but I hate it. Maybe, maybe it's just the, um, like the USB port on this Switch Pro controller is not in good condition. Oh good, got ambushed. That's a one box that has a miracle in it. Let's make another attempt to not die. that puts us in the middle. At least the straw dolls on their own are not too terrible. Like they don't do a whole lot of damage. They the problem is they curse. Which 
can allow other things to come in and do a whole lot of damage. No cursing on stream. I'll tell that to the straw dolls. Oh good, I'm glad that you decided to attack the one that had already attacked and not the one that was about to attack and nearly destroy us. Thanks for that. Well, let's use the rest of our booze. Yeah, a little bit, Jewel. I am I am in agreement with your statement. All that for a miracle. All I need is a miracle. All I need is a miracle. Oh, that's incorrect. Need the one in the middle. I got a surprise attack on these guys. Oh boy. Now, and I want to just stress the point that um, in the vanilla game, the encounter rate is worse. Something that uh makes up your party. Oh cool. Oh and they summon too. That's even worse. What the hell? Alright, I gotta wake up my party here because, like, this is really bad, actually. Uh, then you're going to use a mystery pin on Lufia while you attack. Or get, uh, paralyzed, I guess. Like, I need a friggin' turn to attack here. Now hopefully, I, hopefully she can stay awake for long enough to do this. Awake and alive. Nope. Just before she gets to cast. Now, nah, she she's dead now. Cool. All right. I guess I get to spend the miracle on this, trying to save this from a wipe. Now. Now. 
And we're right back to where we started. What what the what the fuck was that fight? <sighs> you know what? I think I I am going to take the death because I don't think I lose any experience. I lose money, but uh, yeah, we got 15, 16, uh, 16, 15, 16. So I'm gonna accept that. I got enough power to, to help me out. Yeah, at this point we need to stock up and stuff. Back to track. And get a bunch of those. Get a bunch more of those. Um, what do you have? Nothing really super useful. I'm gonna get a couple of ropes. Then we're going to go Should after rather calm the rise of the sinistrals in this I don't know what you mean by that. I know you're talking about the sequel, but I don't know what you mean by what you said. The town with uh, was it Grenoble? Okay, yeah, this is where I wanted to go, and then promptly leave. done some treasure hunting. Don't worry about us. We'll go and find the crown. Sounds like a plan. They could have abbreviated this sequence. Now let's see what treasures we can find here. A potion.
Yes, Jewel, because I, like, th this is a ROM hack. Typically, you can't play those on console. Hey, you're good, Jewel. And then this is Luffy and the Fortress of Doom, uh, Restored, I believe it is. Has some quality of life improvements as well as some translation and uh, some a couple of translation fixes and some uncensoring. And I don't mean that there are like the there's no nudity in this game. It's uncensoring of like religious things and also the liqueur is not, is definitely not liqueur in. Uh, the standard North American version. But yeah, it's like, it's like J-Pop mentioned uh, in the first episode, he was like, the first thing that he was planning on commenti commenting on was the very slow walk speed, which this ROM hack fixes. Nothing, nothing, miracle, and nothing. I feel like it's not that big of a deal to just use bang a lot. Yeah, it looks like the same speed as your Rise of the Sensors version. The only, the only bad thing about the faster walk speed is that it is very easy to um, take one too many steps and then end up where you didn't really intend on ending up. North Tower should be level 16. Well, we're at, we're at level 16 now. So hopefully when we get back there, it's not going to be as bad. I feel like it's still going to be pretty bad. anyone got an upgrade. And a long sword. Is it buckler? And he has probably for Lufia. Oh! We're wearing the monster ring. No wonder my encounter rate was so damn high. What the hell? On the plus side, we uh, we gained some levels from doing that. On the minus side, we also gained a lot of frustration. And heals. Loses attack but gains agility. I mean, the, the tactic that I should be following right now is don't wear the monster ring unless you're specifically grinding for levels. Oh, 
iPhone に行くマニーズ Float, which I think I'll just use right now. Well, that ain't great. I just blew myself. Okay, I guess that was enough for me to. I guess it's once your entire party leaves the,、uh, the poison floor, is when it、uh, stops taking effect. Get out of here. And we did get some,、uh, some gear upgrades from that. We also got the bloody rod, which is definitely cursed. Let's go turn in this crown. I mean, there is, there is something to be said about using cursed items. Because, like, they do have bad effects, but also they have, like, very high stats.、Uh, let's look at this bloody rock for a second. I'm not gonna e q u i p Oh. This actually doesn't have good stats. Okay. How do you remove it? Well, that's easy. You go to, uh, um, this guy. Lift curse. Okay. Also, probably should do. Bit of item sorting.、Uh, yeah, spell source is just something I want to use.、With、the liqueur I want. I'll just put it up here. I don't want to get into a whole sorting thing like I did before the stream. Spell source is gonna go on. By the way, I probably should use the end. I would have to think that if you can remove curses in the first game, you can probably remove curses in the second. Okay, so here we are in Belgium. That's the wrong way. 
No, I, I don't think that uh, the, re the removing curses thing is a new thing that was added. I was like, a lot of the changes are mostly pretty minor. But let me let me bring it up here. Um, so here is the link. Uh, there's a pretty good description just on the front of the page here. And it doesn't mention anything about curses. Yeah, I know. But yeah, you can check out that, uh, that list of things. While I keep beating up ghosts and rats. As far as playing on console, like, the closest thing that I could do to playing on console is either, like, if I did still have a SNES, I could get, like, um, an FX pack. Which, by the way, would also allow me to do things like Archipelago uh, on an actual SNES which would be kind of rad. Of course, I don't currently have a SNES, so... I might be able to get one for pretty cheap at uh, one of the local stores. I don't know how expensive it would be to get a SNES nowadays. Now, I almost got uh, an analog Super NT when those were out. The deal breaker was the $80 in shipping. It's like at the time I would have totally had $200 to, to spend on a Super NT. But that shipping cost was just overkill. And then I would have also had to get an FX pack, which, uh, those are pretty pricey too. Another potential option would be to get, uh, one of the misters. It's some uh, FPGA emulation. Those are also pretty pricey though. Although arguably, probably like, for the value proposition, overall kind of less expensive than the Super ND would have been. I don't remember what the price was when I actually checked. And the other alternative is... I have a Raspberry Pi, which I could also use for emulation, but... I currently use it for a bunch of other things. And in order to use it for emulation, I would have to turn off all of the services that it's running.
And, and I would totally say, like, if you look at a couple of videos about the Raspberry Pi, or a couple of articles, and you're like, hmm, maybe I can use this for something. You probably can. <laughs> Especially since they have the, the Pi 5 out now. I would love to have a Pi 5. Oops. Yeah, you can't use it for everything PC related, but you can use it for a lot of things. commit crimes. I, I, I don't know how useful the Raspberry Pi would be in stealing nuggies from anyone. not to fall off the edge, because that is definitely a thing that you can do. And then we get ambushed by straw dolls again. They managed to not curse us despite trying twice. Try to take out as much of this as we can. But we know how messy these guys get. Okay. will be our key. No one can stop us now. Did you say Amun? Amun, the Sinistral of Terror? No, it's not possible. You know of Amun. That's splendid. Now you shall help us as well. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. So you got a, an attack all on you. Um, trying to use some tactics here.
Yeah, stronger is definitely a spell that is worth having. Drowsy and no one falls asleep. Love to see it. I didn't mean to cast Strong. I wanted to cast uh, Flash. Well, whatever. No weaknesses, just have to chip away. Well, using Drain definitely helps. Oh. That had to happen eventually. Have stronger as well. Great. Oh, and you're gonna use it twice in a row. Fantastic. So all of a sudden this becomes a DPS race. Everyone at 68 HP there. That was kind of neat, actually. One one more point, though. That would have been real nice. That would have been triple nice. Uh, cast it on Lufia, because we need our healer to stay up here. In contrast to um, other things that we've been fighting here, this uh, really isn't so bad. There we go. And Agra levels up. So happy somebody saved me. Kidnapping. <laughs> I won't stand still for such nonsense. In any case, no one was hurt. Can you stand up? Yes, I'm fine. I'll take you as far as the village. Well, Jaren, we have to leave. It's time to say farewell. What? Enjoy the village's hospitality. Take care now, Jared. Eh, excuse me, please, if you don't mind, take me with you. It's dangerous where we're going. We really can't take you with us. We'll be in your way, won't I? I didn't say that. We saved your life. I hate to see you lose it. You're right. Life is precious, isn't it? That's right. Well, it's time to go. Wait, wait a second. Please take this, just to show my appreciation. Julia gets a miracle. That's... That's a sentence. Bill, 
Will I see you again someday? I can't promise. But yes, you will. <laughs> I know. We'll meet again. Someday. I'll take care of myself, Billy, and you take care too. I can't promise that we'll meet again. But yes, we're definitely going to meet again. The issue so far was more the number of enemies than the difficulty, and yeah, and once we took off the monster ring, <laughs> which was the real problem there, that went a lot smoother. Um, so now that that's all happened, where do we go next? I guess let's go talk to people. Yeah, I think that last girl is the one who, um, who was supposed to have been ransomed off. And, uh, she ended up not doing that and Jaren going in her place. Well, let's hope so. Well, no one had anything particularly useful to say. In face Jaren. There we go. East of the desert is the village of Surinago. That was, uh, something at least. I don't think anyone else has anything else to say. Monsters won't attack if you don't wear the ring. I don't think that's how it works, they'll definitely do it less. Uh, where do I go now? There's a big old desert there. That's probably an indication. Cloud's not in this game. We can't battle Cloud. I'm glad at the very least that Get Help only seems to uh, summon enemies of the same type. If he levels up and learns Absorb. To not be the same, like, I don't like the sand. I wish there was fireworks. But instead of the sand? 
I don't know that I would want to be walking around on fireworks. That seems like a really bad idea. <laughs> the Isle of Forfeit. <laughs> It's it's where it's where people go when they can't finish their archipelago seeds. Oh, all items and weapons traded anywhere in the world end up there. That's fascinating. Yes, I have met an elf. Well, half elf at the very least. It still counts, right? Now rob your stuff. Uh, as far as I know. Ah, so that's why you need an elf to reach Elfria. Oh, it's one of these shops where it's like three shops, but it's the same dude. Anyway, this is all bronze equipment. I don't think any of this is upgrades. sucks, dude. Yeah, steal your high potion. What do you think of that? Now, yeah, let's see. I feel like this would be an upgrade if we, have, if we hadn't found that random drop. This wasn't an upgrade to begin with. This up here, however, is an upgrade for Lufia. And this Francisca is an upgrade for Argo. Forfeit is where you go when you struggle and smash TV. Uh -huh. Okay, so we can buy high potions and high magics here. Good to know. Also gonna get a couple of warps, just for good measure. Maybe a couple of mystery pins. Girl. What if we said no? As far as the south of here, you can get directions northwest of the forest. Good thing I said no then. <laughs> Alright, you're Isle of Forfeit, dude. Let's go ahead and save one more time. Actually, I should probably have gone to the inn and then saved. Ooh, 50 gold pieces. Let's see if we can find this lost forest.
Surprise attack, pretty good. Sorry for the little blip there. Oh boy, more high arrows in the face. That's probably the town they were talking about. Which I'm immediately going to rob. Sweet water. Warp. I need to that back room. Oh. There's a door and it is locked. Lost forces just ahead. But you'll never get through without a guide. There's someone who can show us the way? Well, yes, but she's only a child. Do you still want to go? Well, sure. All right, you can come out now. Who would have thought? Hello, Coolio. j jaren I knew you'd come this way if you were continuing your journey. Hey, old man, this child won't do. Isn't there anyone else? She is the only one. Well, you know, let's try it without, uh, without her. We might be able to find the way through by ourselves. Only elves know the way through the forest. But you're not an elf. I'm half elf, so I know the way. But for you, it's not possible. I mean, you're half elf, so you know half of the way, right? That's gotta be how it works. What'd you say, Coolio? Well, what choice is there? We know no other elves. So you'll let me join the party? It's so dangerous. Why do you want to come with us? You saved my life. I want to help you, Coolio. I... I understand. Lead on, Miss Jaren. Just Jaren, please. Right. Let's go, Jaren. Yay! Coolio, wait a moment. Calm down, Lufia. She's just a child. You can't tell with half-elves. And besides, I am calm. All right, all right. Julio, are you really going to let her join our party? There's no one else to guide us. We have to count on Jared. I agree. I don't. Why not? Why? Just, well, just because. That's why. That's not an answer. Come on, let's go. What's wrong, Fufia? Oh, she's just jealous. It's always the same thing. Nothing to worry about. Coolio! Well, we're dead. Super dead. I'll go first, Coolio. Is she always like this? <laughs> I mean, my my HP is a bit low, but I'm pretty sure it's not because of Lufia. <laughs> anyway, now that we have access to back here, we can discover that there are no items to uh, to find in the back here. So let's just go. Comedy, hey Tyrion. So obviously, if um, if we didn't have Jared in the party, 
we would not get these instructions. And I imagine if we didn't have Jaren in the party, and we knew the correct way through, it would still not let us through. Droplet. And what can you do? We got Spark. It's a group of enemies. Oh, we got a warp for magic rather than having to use items. Strong, we got release for paralysis. Detox and Gale. Let's try Gale. Actually, that is a good point, Jewel, um, and that is entirely the reason why I didn't sell all of my equipment. And then I forgot to check her equipment. Gale doesn't do a whole lot. It does about as much as, uh, maybe Droplet, so it hits the entire, uh, enemy party. Rather than just a group. Oh yeah. I mean, it's definitely not the best thing that she can equip, but it's, it's better than literally nothing. It does have the best weapon that we have access to right now. Like such an easy path. And we got a warp zone here. At least it looked like a warp zone. Okay, maybe we don't go this way just yet. Because there was another option. This town, which is probably Elfreya. Actually, no, Elfreya was... The old man just said it was across the other way that we were just at. But we're still going to check this town, though. This is just an old man's house. We will need a guide to get through the walls first, but it's not necessary for you to Oh, we do get to rest for free. It was a good thing that I came here. Alright, so we're nice and well rested. And um, now we just need to find our way to El Freya, which we're going to be doing right after the break. So y'all can take a moment, uh, get something to drink, go to the bathroom if you need to, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth, and in about 10 to 15 minutes we shall um, head to the uh, little archipelago area here and see if we can find our way to Alfreya. So I'll see you in a bit.